tip for you guys yes do go out there and practice your forehand slice guys a lot of people say hey, I never use that shot ball comes out to my forehand side hey I'm gonna drive that thing you know I'm gonna pound it I want to hit a good top spin on it yes I agree you know most people have the forehand side as their big weapon but it's this fantastic thing to have in your arsenal of shots a slice forehand also we all know of the utility of the slice backhand a lot of people use it for approach, coming into the net, keeping that ball low. Wide ball saves, low balls, you know, get down and it's easier to chip under it than to get under the ball to drive it. But hey guys, th this is also as useful on the right side too, if you think about it. You know, you might be getting a short ball, low ball, in which you can come in and do a forehand approach shot to keep that ball low too. Wide ball to your forehand, hey, that might be useful to save. We all know about the squash shot too, when you're late to do it, that's another subject for another video, you know, the squash shot, but the continental grip, chipping the forehand is also very useful in a match. Plus you might get a guy that has a bomb, or a girl that has a bomb of her serve. So instead of trying to drive the return back, you might be setting up with the continental grip to return back chipping, and there you go, you might be returning back a chip forehand to get into the point. So yes, do go out there and practice your forehand slice because it's going to be very useful in a match. Plus, you're already developing the skill also that will be involved in hitting not just the forehand volley, but also a drop shot. So if you get good at forehand slices, eventually you can change a little bit the technique and be very good at hitting short ball drop shots which I can put into my practice too. Sometimes I do that. I'll get a short ball here and I'll come in and instead of chipping it deep, I will just cut in a little short ball drop shot that barely goes over the net. Okay guys? So continental grip, do practice your forehand chip. It's gonna be useful. All you left-handers out there, I never forget you. Here it is, continental grip. I'm even gonna demonstrate it. Let's have a couple balls. Go out there and you practice that forehand chip. A little shorter ball, same thing. Always try to have the racket head above the handle. A little shorter ball, here we go. It's a very useful shot to have. Don't miss out. You can have one less gear in your arsenal. Include the forehand slice, guys. It can only benefit you and you only go to it emergency cases or when you decide to. It doesn't have to be a basic shot for you to go to war with and hit regularly. It's just a go-to shot, an extra shot to have. All right, take care. Cheers, it's a wrap. I'll see you guys next time. Ciao.